Hello everybody and welcome back to Chellington Valley episode 9. I hope you're all well. Welcome back to my channel, This Farming World. Um, as you can see today we are pretty much carrying on from exactly where we left off in the last episode. We're just in the fen and we've got our seed drill here and we're heading over to uh, plant field number 55 or seed even. So we're going to be planting uh, soybeans out there, um, the same as like what we did in our other field next to the farm, field 7. Uh, I just want to do a whole crop of soybeans just to really boost uh, the funds so we can start to buy some more stuff. Um, so yeah, that's what the fence is going to be doing today and the, um, the John Deere will be tedding and probably rowing up our field of grass back at home so yeah after we set the worker off over here on course play we will um, yeah head back and do some tedding and probably row up ready to uh, make some hay bales for the sheep so that is the plan for that so we're almost here so I feel just here on the right next to the castle so let's see We will get these unfolded. Get those beacons off since we don't need them anymore. And we need to do... Which one is this? Yeah, fertilising and seeding. Field 55. Uh, we do three runs of the headland and we just make that a little bit smaller. There's no islands in here, so that's good. I'll just check this is all okay. Okay. So, is that the right way? No, we need to spin around. And then we should all be good. Yeah, go, you all got a lesson on how to use cosplay as well at the same time. So, if we hit drive. I mean, they never get right into the corners, but... So, there we go. That's that. It's planting fine. So, to the John Deere. I'll have a look at the grass. So, if you guys didn't see the episode before, we cut this grass here. This is what we're going to be turning into hay. So, we need to go and grab a tedder. Because we don't believe we own one yet. We'll have to check. Uh, where would it be? I never really buy many tethers in this game. Because a lot of the time I play with seasons. Um, what do we want then? Something fairly cheap. What's that? 8 metres? 8.6. Um, this one's obviously massive. I think we'll just go for the coon. And yeah. That's not too bad, 16,000. Isn't a massive expense. Um, well, not for a piece of machinery nowadays, anyway. So we can head over in our little pocket rocket, uh, pick up the tether, and head back. Uh, I might chuck the chuck it into a time lapse, and um, yeah, see you once we're there.
Okay, we are back, and we have obviously started tedding with our new tedder. It's going well. Um, it's actually not taking long at all, which is um, what to be expected. It's been quite a wide machine, so and you can travel quite fast with it. So yeah, it's uh, making our hay. I think we'll probably be able to get it all rowed up today and maybe even start to bail it, uh, which would be nice. The sea drill's doing okay. Um, yeah, I think he's still going around the headlands. We'll have to check up on him in a minute. But yeah, all of this hay is just going to go to our sheep, uh, and that should increase their productivity to roughly full. I mean, all they need, other than hay, silage and grass, is carrots or something like that, I believe. So, if we check, yeah, so they just need carrots and hay is the only thing we're not giving them. I'm not sure how this map actually works, because just looking at that there, the colour of that grass, I'm not sure if um, it's ready for hay now or if it needs to be left to dry for a bit. Um, we'll have to see. I'll get out and test the uh, test the grass with our little uh, moisture thing. I'll do that now just to see. Just out of interest. Oh, we, I think we have to buy it. Uh, maybe it's in misc. Uh, maybe it only comes on with seasons. It might do. Uh, I can't think where else it would be. Uh, it's not going to be here, is it? No. Okay, well, I'm not sure. We'll just have to have a look in the baler once um, once we start baling it. But I may leave it overnight just to see if that makes a difference. Because it changes colour when you go over the grass again, look, if you see. But, um, yeah, anyway, we'll see. Just this last little bit here. Here we go. Perfect. So that is that done. We'll get that folded up. But see, this looks like hay. And I don't know what this is. This is just uh, even drier grass, I guess. I'm not sure. But this is maybe wet hay. I don't know. We'll have to find out. It's all new to me because I know in the shop... On this map, there's lots of cell points for uh, stuff. See, so, like, this is a wet crop grass, I'm assuming, and a normal grass, horse, horse hay, and stuff like that. So we're having to just sort of work out and hopefully get to hay. Or what else do we need? Dried clover, windrow, dried alfalfa, or dried hay parents, or hay. So yeah, um, we'll just hopefully see what this is. Uh, we might have to just hit the baler on and try um, baling up some of the grass and see what the baler says. For now we can lower this down and um, drop that in front of the mowers. And I will use a round baler out here. So this has got wet grass. Um, but we get rid of that. Uh, what capacity? Yeah, 8,000 litres. We will try just bailing up this stuff here and see what that says. See, that just says it's grass, so that's not dried out enough. Um, what about this over here? So this is hay. So we need to get it all that lighter green, which I thought. So that means tedding it again, I assume, in maybe if in the next day. I am not a hundred percent sure, but we'll have to just see. We'll put the baler back in here for now. If I can reverse. There we go. That's better. And we will check on 
see Drill, see how he's getting on. So yeah, he's doing okay. This is going okay over here. He's not got too long to go. Um, but what I think I will do is maybe skip to the next stage. Hopefully these sheep have got enough water. And they've got plenty of silage and grass over here. So yeah, I'll probably skip to the next day and see if that hay dries out. If it doesn't, um, I'll tell it again off screen so it is ready. Okay, everyone. So I have figured it out. Um, it is definitely not ready. So what we're doing now is tedding it again and that will turn it into this colour grass, the sort of lighter green grass and if we ted it another time uh, then it becomes hay so in total we need to turn the grass three times which is a bit like uh, it's way more realistic than the normal farming sim um, because in real life you have to turn it three, three or four times to depending on the weather though um, to get it dry enough to be hay so this does make sense so what I'll do is I'll ted it uh, now in the morning and I'll ted it this afternoon um, but it doesn't look like it'd be ready to row up today so in this episode we'll just be getting it nearly there because um, I, wasn't, I wasn't sure we we're going to have to uh, ted it three times. I thought it's just going to be like normal farming sim where you ted it once, but that's not not an issue. We can ted it again. Um, so yeah, that is what we are going to be doing. So this is my little test area here. This is where I tested it because some of this grass has already been turned uh, three times, where you like overlap on the corners and stuff like that. But, uh, most of it needs to be done again. So that is what I will do. It's all looking a bit uh, patchy out here now, though. Some of it's ready for uh, hay now, and some of it isn't. But on the final turn, it'll be all nice hay colours. So that will be good. So I think the seed drill's almost finished. We can have a look after we've um, done out here. But yeah, I'm glad I uh, brought a fairly big tether and I didn't go for the one smaller than this. As um, I wasn't, sh I didn't know we were gonna have to do it this many times. Okay, so there we go. It's all been tethered twice now, and a lot of it has been tethered three times. But um, I think what we we'll do is next episode we'll finish off the uh, tedding and get it all done uh, in that episode. So that is the plan. So we'll just leave this tractor in here for now. Switch it off and check on how the drill's getting on. So yeah, that's perfect. He's on his last pass. In fact, we might as well stop him. And uh, take over and just finish up ourselves. Here we go. So yeah, the, this tractor does struggle with this drill. But then it is a very big drill for this size tractor. Um, it's using a lot of fuel on this, that's for sure. Uh, but it's getting it done, so that's the main thing. Slowly but surely. So if we check the map, yeah, this this is all reading as fertilised once and soybeans, so that's good. Here we are, at the end of the run. Perfect. So while we're here, we'll just get this little corn a bit. And then we will head to our little tiny field, our smallest field. And what field number is that? Field 34. And um, yeah, we'll probably get that done. Just get this corner here where he missed. There we go. Perfect. 
so we get this folded up and uh, head down the track. Okay, so there we go, we're down the track. It won't take us long to get to the next field. Uh, but what I think I'll do is uh, probably call it an episode when we get to the next field, just because um, these videos have been quite long recently, and I just wanted to make this one a nice short one, just to um, sort of get back into uh, sort of time scale. I'm not sure how long this one's going to be, but I don't want it to be half an hour long, so... I know it's not going to be anywhere near that, but I just want to make it nice and short. And then next time we can get that hay made and finish this drilling, and then it will be good. We can uh, speed up time and um, get some other bits and pieces done. We've got our grass field that needs uh, to put some fertilizer on. I might put some slurry out there or um, or solid manure. I'm not sure yet. Uh, so that is the plan for that field and then obviously once these grow another stage we can get out and put some more fertilizer on um, so we're here is our field we'll get the tractor in here ready for next time so he's ready to go it's not going to take long out here at all so we'll stop that we will shut this gate up. But yeah, I know it's in a short episode um, today, but it's just to sort of bridge between the two sort of stages of fertilising and seeding and grass. So um, next time we will get the seeding finished finally, once and for all. And we will get the hay made and fed to the sheep. Um, yeah, so that is the plan for next time. So yeah, thanks for watching everyone. Uh, I hope you enjoyed. If you did, leave a comment if you have any suggestions. And uh, give the video a like. And uh, yeah, I hope to see you next time. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.